It's time for Babbling Brook. Woo! and listen to some Babbling Brook. Hey y'all, this is Babs. You know how I feel about trigger warnings and how retarded they are, but under the circumstances, um, I think I have to give a trigger warning. Cousin Cindy's back. Enjoy. Hey, you guys. So, like, I called Uber the other day to get a ride, and the guy who picked me up had, like, a picture of this woman glued to his dashboard. You don't even know. Like, it was so messed up. But I'm, like, super polite, you guys. Like, super polite. So, I just sat there, like, seething for a while because it's really super offensive. But eventually, I totally had to say something. So, in the nicest way possible, like, I asked who the woman in the picture was, and he said it was his wife. And by the way he talked about her, you could tell he was, like, super gooey over her. So... I really had to tell him how seriously offended I was by that picture. I mean, this woman was like super pretty, you guys. And he has a picture of her on his dashboard? Like, seriously. All he's doing is throwing it in our faces that we are not as, like, attractive as she is. And that is so oppressive and offensive because this guy works for Uber. And there are lots of women who use Uber. And if this douchebag picks women up, we have to deal. We have to sit there and face the fact that we are not as attractive as, like, the picture on his dashboard. And that is oppressive and it's offensive and, like... <sighs> Yeah. And this guy was like fucking a white nail, you guys. Like it's not bad enough that we have to get a ride from someone who holds all of the power and the privilege. He also has to rub the fact that his wife is prettier than us in our fucking faces. <laughs> Isn't it enough that you were, like, born into a perfect life and never, like, experienced pain or struggle at all? Isn't it, like, enough that you automatically get anything you want without ever having to work for anything in your whole life? Seriously. Like, rubbing your wife's pretty face in our faces just to make us feel devalued and freaking totally worthless as women is just going too far, okay? I bet she fucking burps rainbows and her farts smell like honeysuckle too. Bitch. So I like said all of this to this asshole and he like kicked me out of his car. You guys don't even know. I hope this guy learns his lesson from me, and I hope all you other white males out there learn your lesson too. It is disgusting to degrade women, you sick fuckers. By the way, you guys, I have really exciting news. Like, I have a new job as CEO of a production company. So check out our website at www.beatmewithit because I'm a sick horror snuff porn. We're currently actually seeking young suicidal women who want to become famous at any cost to be our actresses. So check us out. <laughs>